Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to the game where jaywalking is everyone's favorite pastime. We're back out in Real Estate Simulator, baby. And today, we're going to get rich preying on the poor once again. This time, though, I don't think we're going to be doing too much tent sales because we've expanded out. In my first episode, I earned 50 grand. And would you look at that? There's a house for 50 grand. <laughs> that was not planned for the record. All right, so this one is 52800 but it has a driveway. I feel like that's going to be a great sales feature. I don't know who buys a house without a driveway. I mean, I am Canadian, though, so you have to travel everywhere. Ah, uh, yes, a 50 grand house isn't going to get you much anymore. But you know what? This is actually much better than expected. We got a room to hide the bodies. Oh, we even have a garage. Oh, yeah, that's right. Of course, we got a garage. That's why I, I, I chose this house. All right, it's not bad. The kitchen could be a bit better. Is there anything in the fridge? Just alcohol. Okay, clearly we have a drinking problem over here. All right, what's up, drunkie? 52,000? Uh, I don't have that much. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try something aggressive. Thanks, Let's see what happens here. Oh, not bad. 40,000? Okay, this is going to be a good sale. Definitely a good sale day. All right, the great thing about having $10,000 is we can buy lots of things for this home. So I'm going to buy one of everything, and then I'm going to do the big brain move, and I'm going to buy about 50,000 plants. Only because this is the cheapest item, and it gives me 15 crowns. I, I think if I do the math, that's probably... Oh, actually, the wardrobe might be better. The wardrobe is definitely better. All right, so we're just going to put a bunch of wardrobes in here as well. There we go. $10,000 spent mostly on wardrobes. Oh, maybe I should buy a bed, too. That's that's pro that's probably smart. So we'll drop this down. Oh, you, you, you can't change it when... <laughs> you can't change it when you put it in your thing. So I'll buy the wardrobes again, but let's get a nice poor bed. Screw the walls, because you have to do one tile at a time, and I just don't have the patience for that. So, yeah, we're just going to buy the rest of this in wardrobes. All right, there we go. And now it's time to interior design. Oh, my God, what's what's going on? Is, is the family traveling together? What is this? This feels like a weird version of the Beatles or something. Oh, God, this is great. I love how many people are just walking around in this game and following each other. Where's the house I bought? Ah, uh, here it is. Did I get the car with the purchase or is it just being abandoned here? All right, I gotta say I'm super proud of myself. As you can see, we have maxed out this place. It might not look like much, but you wait. So we don't have much going on here. We got some wardrobes in the kitchen because I kind of ran out of space. I mean, not really. I just didn't want them in the open, you know? Uh, didn't do anything in the bathrooms and whatnot. But this is where the magic truly happens. We have a wardrobe bedroom. I don't think anyone's going to complain. They, they don't have enough storage space. We have a nice bed with a lamp. Oh, I forgot. Hold on. I had to move this because I ran out of space. But there we go. Look at it. It fits perfectly. And if you needed more, well, there's another wardrobe in here. There's actually two in there. Uh, one behind it as well. Now, where are the ferns, you ask? Well, you get a free grow up with this. It's a, they're, they're, they're in the garage. All right, so we have about 47,000 in this. I would love to get 80,000. Let me see what they think of that. Will not be sold in this office. What do you mean? What? How much am I going to get? I spent a long time setting this up. Do I have to go back to 10 sales? 60,000 is high. Did I get a bad deal for this? Because I was earning a hell of a lot more money before. All right, I would love to get 60. Though. Let's see what happens. I need a house with values one to yes, two at suburb, but what about value office. four? Oh, that actually went way better than expected. Hold on. I don't know if I want you because you don't seem that enthusiastic about it. But let's go see if I can still cheese this system. Yes, go go check out my well-furnished rooms. Please look in them. No, actually look in. They're very impressive. Please come back. You don't know the amount of storage space you have. Damn it. Oh, she didn't even see it. She's going to offer something awful. I'll give you 51. No, dude, I'm, that, that would be me losing money. Actually, I would have gained a little bit. Well, I asked for 60. How about thanks, 80? But I'll decline. That, 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 that's fair. What about 70? No, thanks. What about? OK, come thanks, on. I'm getting a little I'll desperate decline. here. 65. God damn it. No, thanks then. Get out of here. I have to go back and sell this thing. OK, this I'm having a hard time. Come on, just give me 60. OK, we got 60. I mean, I'm just happy to get rid of it. So we didn't earn as much as I hoped for on that. But I mean, it was still like 10 grand. Hey. Hey, what are you? Hey, little guy. It's been moved to the office. I do, how did I not see? I, I use this freaking thing every day. How did I not see that until now? Anyways, there's no cheap home, so that's a bit of a bummer. I'm going to go sleep and cry. <laughs> All right, if this person offers me 51000 for this well-thought-out and fur furnished house, I'm assuming every person plays the same then because this is the third person I've sent through, and yeah, 51000 So... I'm assuming every barter is exactly the same. I've been trying to get, I believe, 66,000 no, for this. 
And yeah, that's what usually happens. So I really just no. have to fine tune this to figure out how much I can get for it. Exactly I wanted what I was 60. I'm assuming I'll get 60. I guess that's as good as I'm going to get it. They definitely, the developer that is, changed how much you can earn with these flips, which is a good thing. We're already at 90,000, even with these uh, small profits. And it's not really that small. It's like 10, 20,000. Oh my God, 45 for. to 33. I think this is where I'm going to have to practice a bit more. It seems like buyer, oh, sorry, sellers now are the way to earn some serious cash because what they uh, are asking for is not what they'll accept. All right, don't tell me I don't interior design. I have painted this whole house pink, so you can thank me later. And of course, that only gave me 130 experience. One bed gives me more than that. That's why I, I love my beds. All right, so I did something cheeky. I Every customer I get asked for a one to two star in the suburbs. So I made myself a two star here uh, just to see if I'm offered 51,000 for this as well. Would you look at that? So I'm investing way too much into these homes. Because all these customers want is one to two stars for whatever reason. I'm assuming I have to upgrade my shop uh, if I want to get better customers. Which is a big goal of mine, but I think it's 90000 to upgrade it. So, I know enough by now Thanks, to figure out that I'm probably going to get about this for that. Uh, sometimes it's a no. bit lower, sometimes it's a bit higher. Okay, screw you, man. What the hell's going on? This there we the go. We got sixty grand me. for it. I'm happy with that. Uh, but yes, I, I've pretty much figured out the whole bartering system and how I can earn as much money as possible on these homes just by ensuring I only have two stars, not four. All right, it's a big day. We hit the six digits. So I think I'm going to invest into Office 2 only because I'm very curious what affordable housing really means. Uh, I do know I can get the majority of the cheap homes in this place for thirty to 50000 So we'll see if we can get them cheaper. Obviously, we also get some more purchasing power and more clients as well. So it is a slight upgrade. Plus, I'm kind of sick of living in, you know, the underground. It's kind of depressing coming out of this door every time when I try and sell my successful home. So we're going to go across the street. I believe it was this one. For 75000 we can live above the underground how exciting let's go see what this new office is like oh this is way better way better look at that i got two doors and everything i can open this up is my cat in here that's all i care about hello kitty all right so i'll have to go get some more collectibles later so yes now we're in office two we've moved up in the world but we are a lot poorer now so hopefully we can find one of these alleged affordable homes I also love that I'm still sleeping on a sofa, even though I spent $75,000 on a new office. Maybe I should invest in a poor bed for myself. Oh, wait, can I actually do that? I didn't think about that. Can I actually furnish this place? I'm going to say no, because the bed doesn't want to get any closer to me. Why, why can I pull it out here, but I actually can't put it down? That's a bit of a bummer. And I also can't paint the walls. That is a huge bummer. I wanted to make this place my own, damn it. I guess it is a rental after all. Well, it's not a rental because I spent $75,000 on it. Okay, well, we got three for sale. That's actually rare. 39 is pretty rare. Uh, four, seems like similar pricing. I don't normally see ones in the 30s, though. So I think it just means these homes are slightly cheaper. But I also have purchasing power. So I have to remember that. It should be easier to get these. This house is usually 300000 So it seems like the big homes are where the affordability is going to come in handy. I wonder if I can get this. You know, that, 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 that would be a long shot. But we can try, damn it. Sell it for 85. What about 53,000? Thanks. Yeah, but I'll so. decline. Okay. Ah, yes. Now we get one to four in the suburbs. I always only got one to two. So now it probably pays to max these things out again. I only I have a two star because that's what I think. I was thinking cost. of something with greater costs. Oh, no. We got rich people now. Oh, no. Before we had poor people. One mil okay, frig off, man. You're so just you're just bragging now. Get out of here. Well, well, well. It looks like I'm kind of a big deal now. I can afford the medium sized homes in the suburb now. So that's exciting, because I should be profiting like a hundred thousand a home. See if we can get this for a good deal though. So the great thing about um buying a home is there's no limit to how many times you try. Because when you're trying to sell, you only get three chances. Thanks, but when you're but buying, you can just start very low and take your time going up to get the best price possible. I'll have to I hope no. this doesn't like annoy them or something and their price gets higher and higher the more you ask for things. But this is how I'll I've been doing it. Me. And that ensures you save, I don't know, that was like 60 grand I saved there. There we go. Look at that. I still got 50 grand. I even got an upstairs now. This is exciting. Someone's definitely going to like this home with a lot of beds in it. I promise you that. 
should probably start a bed factory at this point. I mean, I, I have bought so many beds in this game. <laughs> All right, so being this is my bit, my first big boy home, I don't know what to price it at. I would be very happy with 300000 Is that considered a high price? It is. I don't know if that's good or not. Uh, let's find out. This guy's always wants something really I high. Decline. The price offered is too high for Oh, okay, nice. Let's give this option some Okay, I got someone. Thought. Took me a while. I guess these uh, mid-tier homes, people generally just want the most expensive or the lowest price ones. So mid-tier might be a little harder to sell. But look at that view. How are we so high up? <laughs> All right, what are you going to give me? 255. That is still so much profit. It's kind of insane, but I want my 300,000, damn it. That's that's what I asked for. I'll have to say no. Okay. 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 Hold on. I I I don't want to lose you cuz it took a, wh a while to get you. No thanks. Come on. 255. You'll give me 270, will you? Please. This is the yes! perfect fit for And that was a 42% profit. Not the best we've seen, but considering uh the amount that this house costs, it's it's the best we've seen. Okay, not bad. 650 on that. And yes, we need to sell one more house. And we might actually pass the big 1 million as well. I should be able to afford some of the high ticket homes now. I mean, I have 900,000 in my bank. So let's end off the suburbs with a bang. I would love to buy this one. I doubt that's going to work, though. It's well over a million usually. Uh, that is definitely doable. 1, 2, 8, 7. I mean, I can dream. Let's see what happens. Hey, big guy. I, I I know you're asking for a lot more, but let me just try, okay? I'm going to give you literally everything. No, thanks. Okay. Oh, that's not even the exit. Oh, God. Where, this house is too big. Where, where did I come in? Oh, God. Is this it? Okay. All right. Well, it's not as fancy, but I think we can afford this one. So let's go uh, hopefully profit quite a bit on this. This is the perfect Oh, my God. Again. Me. What is up with this? Ah! Oh, okay. I didn't even need to sell it. That's great. So I got 5% sales income and new items. How exciting. And I got this for 500,000. He was asking for 650. What the hell? All right. So we'll go check out the new items. I don't have any more beds anyways. We'll furnish that thing and then move up in the world to the city, baby. All right. So we have a lot more brown as per usual. Brown just seems to be a common occurrence in this game. Uh, just looking at the prices here and how much experience you get. I think again, the bed is going to be the answer. But honestly, bed poor is still the best in terms of experience. I'm just going to have to place a few more. So we are going to invest continuously into poor beds. They really shouldn't show you the experience because uh, people are just going to cheese this like me. But uh, yeah, we should be able to get a four-star house and uh, we'll see how much this thing's worth. All right, here we go. We have a happy customer for the final suburb home. I Hopefully, at least. I hope I can sell it. Um... I want to get a lot of money for this because I got to assume the city is going to be very expensive. So we'll see if we can get 800,000. That would be no great. Thanks. Um, 750. How about that, man? You offered 680. That's 75,000. Good thing I didn't do that. Okay, I guess I'll accept 700. That's still like $200,000 profit, is which is insane. And I figured he'd take that. There we go. All right, so we're at 1.1 million. Hopefully that's enough for a city home. Uh Oh. Oh, God. Oh, I, I I thought it'd be like apartments. No, it's actually like stores. Damn it. Oh, damn it. Damn it. Well, I don't think we're going to afford this anytime soon, but let's go take a peek and see what we can get for two million. Oh, it is an apartment. It's just they're advertised on the bottom, I guess. So, yeah, we are really high up now. You can really see that blue. Why, why is there so much blue? This is nice, though. This is real nice. I mean, I don't know if it's $2 million nice, but what about $1.1 million nice? Huh? Thanks, but I'll decline. Yeah, I figured. Well, I guess we're back here. At least I can feel like a big shot now and buy the most expensive home. At least I should be able to. Oh, wow. They're asking for a lot today. I don't know if I can buy this. Damn it. <laughs> this is the perfect Oh, fit it me. worked. Oh, my God. I got $791 to my name. That's pretty insane considering I just had $1.1 a second ago. I am bone dry, but I am the happy owner of the suburbs mansion, which looks very similar to the rest of the homes except with more doors. You know, I don't mean to complain, but they, they walk around a lot longer the bigger the home is. So selling these homes takes a lot more time because they have to, you know, walk all the way down there. I miss when they just stared at me in the tents. $1,105. did not I pay that? Didn't I freaking pay that? Thanks. I feel like I got ripped off on this thing, so I'm just trying to get rid of it. We'll I'll see what happens. No. Damn it. Exactly what I was okay, looking for. Okay, I got 1.3 for it. So, uh, yeah, I think I just got a real bad deal on this mansion. So I only got an 18% profit. But on 1 million, that's still good. Okay. 
I am now sitting near 2 million. Let's see if I can use my charm to bring some of these. Oh, they're actually cheaper today. Okay, that works out. Holy Jesus. I just have to go see what this looks like. Just because what does a $4 million apartment look like? Ah, that's beautiful. Yes. Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Whoa. Okay. I. You know what? I kind of see it, actually. This is pretty cool. I thought it'd be a lot more expanded out here. I feel like I'd get rid of this wall and expand this out a bit. This is beautiful, though. But I can't afford this. Or can I? Here you go. No, thanks. Oh, well, I guess I can't. <laughs> Oh, these actually don't get too bad. I guess I was just here on a bad day when everything was two million. I probably should have came back once or twice. So uh, yeah, they, they are a little cheaper. Uh, this is more my style, 1.8 million. Okay, well, we have a nice, man, this is a lot worse than the $4 million home. This is nice. I, I, I like this open concept, but very, very small for the price. But again, I have to remember it's a skyscraper. So that's, that's kind of to be expected. So let's try one six. This is the I should have tried something way lower, shouldn't have I? I feel like I got ripped off. Okay, thank you. Okay, got a bit of a problem, guys. Um, the whole bed strategy is not gonna work anymore. Well, it, it, it works. Why can't I put one there? Why won't you let me put one there? I can't put one over here either. It bothers me so much. Uh, so yeah, I, d I literally don't have enough <laughs> room to add enough beds. The suburbs homes only took 10 beds. We are at... 22 beds in here. I'd have to get eight more in, I believe, to max this thing out. That's not happening, man. There is no way I'm going to be able to fit more beds in here. I could do the normal thing of, like, furnishing walls and whatnot, but that's not fun. At least for me. So we're just going to sell this as a three-star with uh, 22 beds. I feel like that would intrigue some buyers, you know? So I guess now it probably would be smart to buy the more expensive beds because the floor real estate uh, is becoming too aggressive. All right, but this still should be great. So, yeah, we bought it for 1.6. We invested 5,000 into beds. Oh, and we can have five stars now. Oh, God. Okay, so, yeah, we really got to change our bed strategy later to something smaller. Uh, but, yeah, we still should get a decent amount for this. So, I'm going to try 2,005... 2.5 million. This would not be sold in this office. Oh, dude, do I got to get the better office to even sell these, really? Yeah, I... Okay, I... What? Why wouldn't you warn me about this? I can't even sell it for what I bought it for. All right, so yeah, it seems like the highest I can go is 1.3 million. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry, but this price is higher than I expected. <laughs> I can't believe I'm they let interested. me do this. I'm sorry. Um, so I, I can buy this for yes, more than I'm I can sell it for. Let's look. see if I can break even with my stupid freaking office. So I'm gonna have to really use my charm here. I mean, I'm, I'm telling her I'm selling it for 1.3, but that's not the plan at all. She has to see all these beds and go, ooh, this is this is definitely worth the investment. All right, so time to work my magic. I'm gonna stand on the bed to assert dominance first and foremost, and then I'm gonna ask for my my money back. Please. Thanks, but I'll decline. P please, I, I literally have to sell this to move on. <laughs> all right, so we're gonna have to take a major drop here just to sell this thing. Um... If I can get 1.3, that'd be great. This is the perfect yes! fit for me. I'm so happy that I lost $300,000. Yay. Oh, maybe next time warn a man before you uh, <laughs> buy a $2 million home and you can't even sell it. All right, so because we don't have a choice, uh, we're, not, we're upgrading our office not once, but twice in this freaking episode. And would you look at that? Let's go see what the $1 million office looks like. Okay, that's definitely wor wor worth it. This is so much cooler. Oh, my God. Oh, <laughs> I have blinds that I, I have privacy blinds. <laughs> it's all worth it now. One, one million dollars and I get blinds. Where the hell am I going? Oh, that was back out of the street. There was offices back there. I don't know what you're talking about. All right, guys. Well, I'm kind of a big deal now. We have our maxed out office. We are working in the city and uh, I have my little adorable cat as well. So yeah, then we're going to wrap up this episode and ultimately this series here only because it's just so repetitive. There's not much else to do. We've kind of hit the max now. I mean, obviously I could earn a crap load of money if I want to, but we've already pretty much done that. So I'm going to go sleep on my freaking couch again. One million dollar office and I'm still sleeping on a couch, but okay. And uh, yeah, call it a day here. I hope you guys enjoyed this chaos. As always, thanks for watching and liking. And I'll see you in the next one.